It's Tuesday, June 14, 2007, and you're watching The Ointment. Today is Flag Day. I'm Steve Tatum, and here's what I want out of my Flag Day. I'd love to figure out how they fold the flag into those nice little triangles. Our top story, a couple of members of the Bush administration have been subpoenaed by a congressional committee to discuss the politicizing of the Justice Department. Remember Harriet Myers? Well, she was proposed by President Bush as a nominee for the U.S. Supreme Court, and... Uh, her qualifications were, let's say, a bit underwhelming. Well, now she's subject to subpoena. And when asked for comment, Ms. Meyer said, what's a subpoena? President Bush doesn't have much luck getting members of his own party on board with immigration reform, so he met with some GOP members of the U.S. Senate yesterday to plead with them to try to pass some immigration reform legislation. Here was the angle he took to get these guys in line. He said, look, if we pass immigration reform and make illegal alien citizens, your servants will be able to vote for you. The Bush White House has hired high-powered lobbyist and former Republican official Ed Gillespie to be its White House counsel to advise it on legal matters. You know, legal matters like keeping the Justice Department from being too political. So they hired a lobbyist. This would be like hiring Chevron to advise them on environmental policy. Oh yeah, they already did that. Here's my advice. If they want to get out of this mess in Iraq, they want to get out of this quagmire, why don't they hire Henry Kissinger? You know why that joke really isn't funny? Because he's probably already working for them and I just don't know about it. There's more hoopla over Paris Hilton here in jail serving out her month and a half sentence for violations of her probation. Her parents came to visit and the other prisoners protested. Apparently they were afforded some special privileges. Now I don't know if you've seen that reality show with Paris Hilton's mother. Perhaps mom is the one who should be incarcerated. In other entertainment news, director Steven Spielberg has officially announced that he's endorsing Hillary Clinton for President of the United States. He thought long and hard about his choice and he finally decided that uh, Hillary deserved his support because she really is the best actress in a leading role. And finally, in other news of the 2008 election, candidate Rudy Giuliani has a new platform from which to campaign. He's calling it his 12 vows. And you got to say, this is a guy who really knows what he's talking about when you consider the number of times that he's taken wedding vows. That's the ointment for another day. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Steve Tatum. And that's news. We'll catch you tomorrow, everybody. Our top story, a couple of members of the Bush administration have been subpoenaed by a congressional committee to discuss the politicization, politi politicizing, pol politicizing, let's say that, politicization, polit politization, politicization.